Right, so this blanket I'm making here is very small right now because it's for a newborn. And I've only used one stitch, which is the triple crochet. So it's very, very simple. If you can just practice the triple crochet, once it looks good on a small sample, then you can start making a blanket. And practice makes perfect. So just get going. And this part of the blanket that I'm putting the board around, I'm going into both stitches. Well, the chain you can only really go through one because it's not really as easy to um, border that off. But I'm using, I'm starting the border with the same colour because as you can see, this edge is a little bit scruffy compared to the top and the bottom, which the bottom is a chain. So that's still a little bit fiddly because you kind of have to get into a rhythm of where the stitches go. So I'll teach you how to do a triple crochet. So you go in and then pull through two and then pull through two again. There's your triple crochet. And again, pull through two, pull through two again. Pull through two, pull through two again. And you just continue this pattern all the way around the blanket. I love this way where you use both sides of the stitch but the way you get this ribbed effect is by always every time you turn to start a new row you always use the back loop turn again use the back loop and it creates this really really lovely texture a good hobby the amazing thing is you can use what you create my grandbabies love their crochet blankets so does my husband he's a massive fan I'm going to continue to show you how to do the triple crochet border until we get past the corner because I just want to show you how to do the corner which is pretty much the same as what we've been doing just triple crochet but on each corner we need to add three triple crochets so that we can get around the bend nicely without it being tight. Be very big. So we're in the corner now. So we do one, two, three, all into the same stitch. We're going to go into the next stitch. We're going to take a look at our corner to make sure it's nice. Looking good. Right, so now we're on to where we started the blanket, the first row, which was the 85 chains. And this one hasn't, it's not as easy. Again, it's like this little bit of a rough side. So we just need to start off, follow the same kind of pattern as we go along. make another 
video when it comes to making the final border and then you can see what little clothing items I made for this bunny. So thanks for watching.